Kobaba was 90 on this both PBR finals. Probably going to get a rewrite, I'm thinking, maybe. But unfortunately for Rodgers, if that stays a zero, that's going to be a very quick buck off. And this is scary to see. He needs to be helped up. And sports medicine immediately out there. Watch this bull leaves there. Just hits him on the post. Bam, right there. And he kicks. Oh, and then he lands on it backwards. Oh, oh, I don't know if you can see that. Ah, that ankle's pointing the wrong way. Oh, boy. She told me to keep you in line, by the way. Oh, oh boy. Let's just hope Chase Doherty in a game of millimeters. It looks like he avoided that crazy contact from walking tall. And you can see Doherty is fuming after that buck off. This bull goes a couple of jumps further than I was kind of expecting, but just watch these belly rolls in there. And it just gets chased on the end of his arm and then just whips him down and then just inches away. Ooh. Yeah, watch you, it here. Uh, you watch where this foot lands really close. Ooh. It actually just looks like, yeah, it grazed that, that face mask. Grazed that grill a couple different times. Ouch. <laughs> You heard it from Chase, ouch. But he does not seem worse for wear, as even though he starts with a zero, Dakota can't get set to the outside because it won't work on this one. Tossed to the side like a rag doll. That's his first buck off of the weekend. When he had a pretty good chance at him. Deep dirt. Kind of made him not kick quite as hard as I've seen him. He's the outside right there again. He's the outside. He's trying to kick loose, but he just goes too far and puts the pressure on that inside leg and it comes out. Good effort, but you got to correct those mistakes, even though it was working on the first two here in Jacksonville. Dakota tastes some of this Florida dirt as Denner Barbosa gets his opportunity to go three for three. How much more? Well, here we go. Well, you mentioned the kryptonite. There it was. It's an 0 for 2 weekend for Lemmy. That hasn't happened in 2021. I think you've got to go back to sort of mid-season of 2020, the last time he was blanked. Well, and I was just about to say the Bulls that really have some forward movement and drop around to the right tend to have a little trouble with him. And I don't like to see him holding that wrist and that riding arm like that. He's got a couple weeks off before he'll have to perform again in Las Vegas towards the middle of June. We hope our world number one is okay. He may lose that ranking, however, by the end of the day because slotted into 10th, headed to yet another championship round is Kaiki Pacheco. Came into the day about 20 points behind so far. This is Kyle Jones facing DJ Long John. Long John makes short work of the Missouri man, and we have another rider unable to move two to two. Yeah, and this bull's got a real famous daddy. His, this bull's daddy's the world champion, Long John, direct son out of him, and got a lot of his daddy's traits there with the color and the up and down and the spin the boot. Brings Kyle down early. Kyle, another one of those guys now that's just going to have to watch and wait. He's outside the top 12, and unless some of those other guys get injured above him, his weekend is over.